Okay guys, welcome to another episode, I think it's episode 4 actually, of what the bloody hell is this? And this is where my Excel random game generator, which has all 68,000 ROMs that I've got in my computer, randomly picks a game for me to play, so it could be absolutely anything. So without, without much further ado, let the drum roll commence. <laughs> And it's Advanced Destroyer Simulator on the Amstrad CPC 464. So let's take a look. That is the advert for the game. Never heard of it. So let's go. By Tony Hugui, Futura 1990. Actually, I was actually hoping it was going to be a Codemasters simulator, but it looks like something completely different. Right. Houston, we have a problem. It's all in... is that French? I think it is. I did German at school, so I couldn't really tell you. I think that looks French to me. Let's just go for a numero uno. This is going to be fun. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be fun. It's a simulator and it's in French. But you know what? I've got to try and play it. Right, okay, um I presume I'm in a, some sort of boat. You can see there the screen is really, really wee. Now, at least there's some uh, some English damages. There's radar, there's sonar, fuel, speed, depth. And the depth thing seems to be up and down. I'm trying to move the joystick and I'm not having much luck at all. I do like the, uh, the fact that you're actually in the water, you're kind of bobbing up and down. Oh, hang on, hang on, I've got some action here, I think. Right, the speed is moving. Oh, I'm now controlling it. Can I fire? Doesn't look like it. Oh, it's, yeah, it's quite nice polygons. Have I got to destroy that? I'm guessing that's another boat. Oh, don't get too close. Right, there's a, a radar of some sort. Where I'm going, it is anyone's guess. I mean, I'm guessing these wee bits in the water are just kind of light effects. I like the clouds. I mean, it's quite it's quite nice looking, I've got to say. But I have not got a single clue what I'm supposed to be doing here. Oh, we've got some land. That's quite impressive. Oh, hang on, we've got something else. Or is that the same boat? <laughs> That's so earlier on, I've really no idea. Oh, hang on, there's two. Is that a submarine or something? I've got no idea. Let's see if we can run into it. Yes, Collision A Grandivitis. Is that game over? Oh, right, okay, that was game over. Let's try a different mission. Let's go for... Let's go for number two. See if it's any different. Right, we've got that little... Is that a boat or something with a flag in it? Who knows? Depth, I wonder, am I a submarine or am I a destroyer? I've really no idea. And I have just crashed once again. Votre, no, oh, it's too quick. Right, enemy repair Sukarti. Right, I've got no idea at all. Let's go for number four. Yeah, as you can see, picking games is completely, utterly random. <laughs> and unless I'm physically not able to play, i.e., load the game, then I'm going to have a look at it. Right, there is a complete dearth of anything on the radar. Well, we're heading east anyway. Oh, hang on, why is that sonar light lit up? Let's try and turn around and see if we can find something. Oh, 
full steam ahead. I do apologise, I have got no idea what happened there. In fact, you know what it was? I'm, I'm randomly uh, pressing buttons to see if I can do something. Uh, I think that was F1 I pressed. <laughs> I'll just leave that bit in. Yes, I dare say it's a wonderful game if A, you know how to control boats, and B, you can speak French. Though a complete lack of any instructions probably doesn't help either. Right, there's another boat, let's just ram right into it, just to finish off. I don't know whether that's good or bad. Is that an enemy ship? Is it an ally? I have got absolutely no idea. Let's go down in a blazing glory. Kaboom! Yep, that is it. Anyway guys, thank you very much for watching.